Hey guys, um, I'm selling candy to raise some money. Um, I have gummies, I have chocolates. Do you guys want to take a look? You aside, you dirty girl. What is wrong with you, crazy lady? Stand up. The only woman you should be interacting with is me. Not with this low life, dirty girl. What is your problem, lady? I'm sick of the situation. I can't find a decent job, and I can barely make enough to not starve. Now that I think about it, I haven't had anything to eat all day. I really don't know how long I can keep up like this. Hi, miss. Um, I am selling candy. I have these chocolate ones, like these gummy ones right here. Would you be interested in buying some for me today? You're such a pretty girl, but no, thank you. Not right now. Are you sure? Yes, thanks so. The truth is, um, I haven't sold any candy all day and I'm really hungry. Are you sure you don't want to buy any? You know what? The lady that helps me around the house, she just quit today. And I could really use an extra hand. And you seem trustworthy. I, I would love to. Well, you'd have your own room, a warm bed, and most importantly, food on your plate. So what do you say? When do I start? Well, you could start today. What do you think? Thank you. Come on, come on. What are you doing here? Oh, it's you. Uh, nothing, I was just out for a walk. Well, stop doing that. I need you to take me to the mall to buy me new dresses. Yeah, no, I'm not gonna do that. And what are you even doing here, Erica? We had a deal, we were not gonna see each other on Fridays. I do what I want, when I want. And if I told you that was just so you would be quiet. Why are you even doing this? I'm trying to be peaceful about everything, even though our families have this obligation that makes us be engaged. The truth is, I like making your life miserable. And you would have to deal with it for the rest of your life. No, you know what, no. I I'm not gonna do that, I'm sick of this. What do you mean? I, I mean, I want you to get out of my life. I don't ever want to see you again. What do you think my family would have to say about this? You know what, I could care less about you and your arrogant family. The only reason we're even engaged is because of the stupid agreement that they have. But you know what? I don't care anymore. You are going to pay for this. You know what? You do whatever you want. That's to show you that you will not be playing games with me. I hate you so much, you witch. Who are you? You don't recognize me? Should I? I'm sure your crazy girlfriend sure would. Oh, that's right, you're the girl from the park the other day. You were selling candy. Yeah, and now I work for your mom. Oh, okay. Well, um, since it's like that, make me a cup of tea. Can you say please? So, how do you prepare tea? I've never used a teapot before, or have ever drink tea. But I guess he's the boss. All right, where's my tea? Here you go, sir. What is this? It's cold and- Are you serious? This is disgusting. <gasps> this guy stained my favorite dress. Now I'm gonna have to change. Great. Sorry for staining your dress. If you want, I can show you how to make 
tea the right way. From that moment, I felt something I've never felt before. He wasn't like the other guys. He had clear goals, aspirations, and passions for what he did. And over time, I started feeling attracted to him. Maybe it was his smile or the way he looked at me. He was really good at hiding his feelings. Maybe that's what caught my attention the most. The question was, did he feel the same way about me? What are you doing? Remember what I told you about talking to other women? Just don't even worry about her. She works here. I can't believe this. What is this lowlife girl doing here? You don't even know me. Hugh, shut up. Now explain to me what this skank is doing here. First of all, I don't owe you anything, all right? But since you need it, my mother hired her. Well, I want you to fire her right this moment. I live here. How is he going to fire me? This house has gone to waste. It smells like poor people and traitors. This place doesn't deserve my presence. Excuse me? You know where the door is and you can leave. Mom, I didn't know you were here. Do you think that I'm gonna allow you to speak about Kayla that way, much less my son in my home? You are not the person that I thought you were and you are not the person for my son. And as for the agreement, you can tell your parents, it's off. Well, that's not going to be possible. The agreement can't be broken. All three of you are going to pay for this. What did I do? Shut up. You're so annoying. Daddy, you won't believe what just happened at Samuel's house. I'm gonna teach her a lesson. Go for it. These people are a bunch of idiots. Stop it! You're going to pay for this! Are you going to pay for this? I'm sorry, son. I didn't know this woman was gonna turn out like this. It's okay, Mom. There's no way you could have known. Don't worry about it. Well, I guess now we don't have to worry about her, babe. Babe? Uh, since when? Well, I guess now she knows. Kayla, it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. Go after her. Sorry we didn't tell you sooner, Mom. Oh, it's honey. Do you think I didn't see the way the two of you look at each other? I mean, I'm really happy for both of you. Now, go get her. Okay. Good morning, beautiful girl. Good morning, babe. Hey, could you make me a cup of tea, please? I actually already made you one. Oh, okay. I know you had a super busy morning. Well, thank you. It's funny, I remember when you were working here, you didn't even know how to make tea. It was all cold and bitter. You gonna pass the test this time? You're so funny today. I remember when I first started working here, I didn't even know how to boil water. Now look at me making tea. Yeah, well, oh shoot, I'm so sorry, babe. I've gotta go to work. Wait, don't forget your tea. That is amazing. Amazing job. Have a good day. Now I understand that God's plan was always to help me find a way here to a warm home and lovely family. And even though it was a rough way here, I was able to turn my life around. Who would have guessed that my home would be Samuel?